Sunday's sermon was on Ecclesiastes 3, which tells us that God has placed eternity in the human heart. It's a mysterious line, but what I think it means is that we are made in God's image. How are we made in God's image? Well, we're like him in our creativity. It might just be an echo of his, and yet we can create and reshape the world around us. We're like him in our wisdom. We are able to reflect and discern and understand. It's a mystery, for example, that the whole of creation is written in a mathematical language, that something that has arisen in our brains can describe everything around us. And the third way we're made in the image of God is we've got the capacity to love. God himself, the New Testament tells us, is love. The Christian faith tells us that God is loving community, which we call the Trinity, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. So what does it mean that we have eternity in our human hearts? It means that we have a longing for God's eternal self, a longing to share in his love and community. And that's what he invites us to. Through his son on the cross, we are invited to love in community forever. That's the prize that awaits all those who claim it through Jesus on the cross. Have you claimed that for yourself? Do your friends and family and neighbours know that wonderful prize? Eternity in the human heart is an invitation to relationship with God forever.